Isaac. Isaac. Wake up, Isaac. Hey guys, it's Isaac here from Final Smash Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. Let's continue. Pull yourself together, Isaac. It looks like I'm laying in a boat. In a boat with... What is that, a masthead? Well, have you come to your senses yet? You are surprisingly dull-witted. Oh, gee, thanks. Did I startle you? I suppose that is only natural. As wide as the world is, I am the only boat upon it who can speak the words of men. I am the king of red lions. Do not fear, I am not your enemy. Cool. Isaac. I've been watching you since you went to the Forsaken Fortress to rescue your sister. I understand how your desire to protect your sister, sister, not sister, <laughs> could give you the courage to fearlessly stand up to anything. But such a bold attempt was foolhardy. I suppose you saw him, the shadow that commands that monstrous bird. His name is Ganon. He who obtained the power of the gods, attempted to cover the land in darkness, and was ultimately sealed away by the very power he hoped to command. He is the very same Ganon, the Emperor of the Dark Realm, the ancient or the Emperor of the Dark Realm the ancient legends speak of. I do not know why the seal of the gods has failed, but now that Ganon has returned, the world is once again being threatened by his evil magic. Tell me, Isaac, do you still wish to save your sister from him? Yep. And will he do anything to save her? Apparently. <laughs> I see. In that case, I shall guide you as we go forward, advising you on what you should do and where you must go. Ganon cannot be defeated by human hands, let alone by what little strength you possess. Uh, thanks. <laughs> the key to defeating Ganon is locked away in a great power that you can wield only after much toil and hardship. Do you understand? Yep. In that case, we depart to the Great Sea. Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. This is actually a bit embarrassing for me to admit, but although I am indeed a boat that possesses the power of speech, I possess no sail, and a boat with no sail can sail no seas. I have brought you, um, I have brought you far to the east of the dark gaze of the Forsaken Fortress. On this island is a town of merchants who deal in a deal in a wide variety of goods. If you search the land hard enough, surely you can find one who will sell you a sail. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but without a sail, I will be useless to you. This island of merchants is home to many valuable goods. The information they provide you may come in handy during your endeavors at sea, so listen carefully to their words and heed them well. But remember, there is no time to play. Come back here immediately as soon as your errands are done. All right, guys, we are on Windfall Island here, and um, it's the kid gang and the old ladies, and oh, oh yeah, this feels like home already. They got pigs. All right. Oh, oh, if you please, young boy there, please help me. Please listen to my tale of woe. Uh, ew, no. Oh, I'm sorry. That's terrible. Why? That's just awful terrible. You mean, child, what harm could it possibly do to you to simply listen to the quest of a poor and miserable man like myself? What harm, I ask you? Sorry, dude. It's just I'm, I'm kind of busy. I was, I was doing the intro to the clip. Uh, so, guys, last time, the, or just a second ago, not last time, the King of Red Lions commissioned us to go find a sail. So we need to find and buy probably a sail somewhere in this town so that we can go uh, back to the Forsaken Fortress again and save our sister. Um, so let's just start out by talking to some of these guys. And old man, yeah, I will talk to you now. Sorry. Eh? Then fine. Be gone with you, you wretch. I will find another to ask. Go away. <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, I guess that was like a one-time thing. 
Uh, yeah, he says the same thing. I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't know it was so important to you. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, you. What's up, little legs? Tis a peaceful place, this here island. The people here would never even dream of leaving their little paradise and send sail on a voyage at sea, you know what I mean? Why, this town is full of faces that don't even show the slightest interest in the sails of a ship. Are we, are we sailors the only ones? Has no one else set out on the great sea? Okay, so he says no one's interested in sails, uh, which is not a good sign for us. So let's talk to this guy. You say you want to sail for your boat. Tell me you're kidding with me. Listen up, lad me. Laddie, not lad. Listen up, laddie. Try using your head a little more. What makes you think a bloke like me, a guy who makes his living off the sea, would give away the very sailing gear he needs to survive? Look elsewhere, laddie. Okay? So he's not going to help us. So guys, right now, if we need to buy a sail, it looks like we're in a pretty good position to do so, because we've got 260 bucks. Oh, there we go, there we go, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, guys, so I made it across here. That was pretty slow and boring. Oh, jeez, Link. You almost jumped into the water. I just came all this way. Okay, so over here, there's a pot. Got five bucks. I think we can climb these, right? Yeah, okay. So we can use these vines to climb up the back of the house, and it looks like we're gonna crawl through here. All right, guys, we're thieves. This is what, this is why we we're trained as pirates. We're thieves. This is our time to shine, guys. Woo! Oh, dang! I want that. Oh. Um, how'd you sneak in here, you little rat? Shoo! Beat it! Scram, vermin! No, I want this cash. All right, we just made like ten bucks. All right. Thieves for the win! Alright guys, so I went around and we're about to get back into this house. Back to the money shelf. We're here. There we go. That that way we get all the money. Oh, dang it! <laughs> oh. Did he see me? He's looking at me, guys! He's looking at me! Yeah, you just got robbed, buddy. Uh, let's find out what's up here. Hey, buddy. Or hey, dude. You don't look familiar at all, buddy. Are you some sort of tourist or something? <laughs> if you are, I'll show you around. Why don't you join me for a little stroll around town? Our windfall island may be, may be a little cozy, so to speak, but people from all over the world come here. The town's always lively. Haha, uh -huh. why, just walking around and having a look at things is quite fun. That's the mark of a great town. Okay, cool. Guys, this might be dangerous. You never know. Excuse me. What are you doing? Oh, no, that's not it. That's just not it. And the problem is, even though that's not it, this isn't it either. Oh, my goodness. Oh, dear. Pardon me. Pardon me, guy. I was so fully and wholly absorbed in my dancing that I didn't even notice little old you standing there. I am taught. I love dancing more than I love three meals a day. You will come to know me as the world's char charismatic dancer extraordinaire. Ready, guy? One, two, one, two. Say, guy, you remind me of what I was just reminded of? Oh, you <laughs> Say, guy, you know what I was just reminded of? Long ago, I met this delightful little guy who performed the most dazzling magic dance. A dance that turned night into day right before my very eyes. I can remember those fabulous dance moves, but I just can't seem to get that intricate rhythm down. Do you think you know the rhythm guy? Uh, no, sorry. What's on here? Okay, so this guy just dances forever. That's nice. Uh, before we go in there, let's check out up here. Okay, okay, this goes into the main town. We're almost done with outskirts, and then we can head in. Alright. So, in here we've got some... Oh, oh, see? See, it is fruitful to break the pots. Uh-oh. What have I done? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hooray! Thank you all so very much! Here is Tingle's heartfelt gift of thanks. Tingle? Tingle? Gulu Limpa! Become an item! 
Oh my gosh. He's good. <laughs> you got a tinkle bottle. Using me first, you can insert a message you've written and send it out to see for someone unknown to receive. Okay. Set it set set it to and use it with Y, X, or R. Be aware that you can't write letters if you're not connected to Meverse. I don't really care. Mr. Ferry, are you familiar with Meverse? With it, blah, 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 blah. Communication is hard beating as one. Nothing unpleasant, okay? Yeah, Tingle Own Island. Will you come find him? Sure. Oh, Mr. Ferry, you don't you want to come to my island, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? You got Tingle's chart! What kind of chart could it be? Head out to sea and then check your charts on the map screen to find out. All right. Open it on the map screen. If you never, ever need any help with your charts, just leave it to Tingle. Don't ever forget it. Okay. Um, goodbye. And if you'd like to give your Tingle bottles that extra oomph that all Tingles crave, you should check out the back of this cell. Check it right out. Okay. Um, I think we just committed a felony, guys, or something. Because I think we just let out a, a prisoner. Okay, so it looks like there's something back here, but we don't really have time for this, so, um... We'll come back here some other time, maybe next episode. And uh, but we, of course, we have time to to break the bottles, guys. Like, who doesn't? Wait, can I pick this up? Oh, I can pick this up. All right, yeah. All right, guys. So we need to get into town before we're out of time for this episode. So let's keep going. Uh, all right, guys. So I'm just walking around looking for a sail. Um. I haven't really found anything yet, so I'm sorry. We're going to pass you by. This guy looks like he's selling something. Literally. My story's a strange one. I came across cursed seas from a land far away. A land where the blizzards blow violently, heading for this town called Windfall. But dear me, as I traveled, a terrible storm descended and tore my ship to bits. Yet mysteriously, only that escaped without such a mark. Only that escaped without so much as a mark on it. Um, from the looks of you, I would say that you are a traveler as well. Oh, yes, indeed. Could you not purchase, purchase that from me? It is my one and only heirloom from home. The people of this town do not seem the least bit interested in that, despite the fact that it would help them travel the dangerous seas about their town. Please, I beg of you, I wish to open a business here in town, so I am in desperate need of finances. How does 80 rupees sound? What is that? Maybe it's a sale, so I'll buy it. Yes, yes, thank you very much indeed. Yes, yes, yes. Who is this, Tom? Look... I can use these funds to finance my new business. Oh, dear me, what a happy day. Very well, young master. As I promised, please take that. Yes, it was a sale. Uh -huh. All right. Yes, yes, yes. You have made a good purchase today, my young master. And you have saved my life and business as well. Treasure dearly. It is the finest sale in the world. Treat it as such. Um, That's not true, because later in the game, you can actually get a better sale, but whatever. All right, guys. So we just got ourselves the sale, and I think that we should go... Talk to the king of red lions and uh, steer away from the kids gang. So, that was stupid. That was stupid. All right, guys, let's go talk to the king of red lions. I think he, yeah, he's over that way. He's over that way. We're going the wrong way. All right. All right, guys, so we're here with the king of red lions. Oh, that look in your eye. So you found yourself a sail, have you? Very well, then. I shall teach you the art of sailing. Come next to my hull and press A to climb aboard. What's the sail you got with A to get moving? The sail will catch the wind, which will push the boat forward. The up that appears behind me indicates wind direction. Use L to steer. If you wish to move quickly, you should keep the wind blowing directly into the sail. You can always press B to put away the sail. Try it when you want to adjust your speed. Do you understand all that? Yeah. Ah, one more thing. When you are out at sea with a few landmarks to go by, you will be at the mercy of your sea chart. I've marked the place we should currently be heading for on your sea chart. If you get lost at sea, select map displayed on the Wii U gamepad to open your sea chart. Whoa, I'm lapsing into... To open your sea chart. You can also pause the game with plus and confirm your position. Now, a westerly wind blows. Hop in and let it carry us to the east. Well, guys, I'm afraid that's all the time we have for today. So, I think we're going to have to end the episode here, unfortunately. But I will see you next time, and we will sail the seas, guys. So, I will see you in the next episode. Have a good day. Goodbye.